Hello. It's been close to a year since I posted last. Not a whole lot new. I've been working in the shop like I always do uh, on air manifolds. Um, this is the prettier of the two, but I don't have all the fittings I need. That one, um, whoa, wait, there's my hand. That one back there uh, works really good, even though it's really ugly. Um, I needed that in order to be able to run uh, the air so I could, the compressor's not on, thank, thankfully. So I could run the air to blow things off and simultaneously run the mist coolant system on both the lathe and the mill. Which, I suppose, if it's not something you need to concern yourself, why would you? But I do. This doesn't look like it, but this shop is built outside in the back of a shop, tr uh, in the back of a box truck. And so I'm beholden to the weather. If it's 32 degrees out or 42, whatever, the metal is the same temperature. And that's notably difficult on my body, uh, where it wasn't once upon a time. It certainly is now. Uh, and yes, it is a challenge to keep the flash rust off of my machinery. But uh, a spray bottle full, filled with WD-40 and some shop towels to put over the drape over the top of my machinery, and I've been able to manage the flash rust um, adequately. And that's kind of a big deal. Ooh, what? There's a mess over there. <laughs> it was something to do, I suppose. Uh, and I don't know if there's any projects today. This is just a check-in. Like, hello, uh, Sean is still here. Uh, and I'll probably still be here um, later on today. <laughs> At least that's as far forward as I want to plan. Now, I don't have a remote camera working right now. So, the goal today is going to be to set up the uh, mist coolant system on, uh, I have two of them. Uh, the second one has the option to turn off the coolant flow and just have air. And that's the one I want to get functioning today. So, I'm going to do that. Man, that really wasn't a lot of work. So this one uh, has two outlets. Uh, I don't know if I can get my hand out of the way to see. Um, so it's got just the oxygen, and then it has the, the mix right here for the oil, which is in a container. Uh, which direction? There. <laughs> which is in a container back over there. Um, so that's kind of a thing. <laughs> I can figure this out. It's funny. Like, it's... I suppose, if anybody's curious, when I finally get a remote camera going again, I'd love to do a shop tour if there's any interest. Like, there's a lot of stuff in here that I'd like to share. Anyway, uh, until next time, thanks for coming by for a visit. But don't forget to like and subscribe. I know there's not much, but, you know, at least I'm consistently inconsistent, right? <laughs>